Welcome to Today in Sneaks. Hope you all had a wonderful weekend. I am fresh back from Portland. If you didn't know, I went to Nike headquarters and you can see the video about that right here. So I want you to check that out. But for now, let's talk about some sneakers and a release date change for the LeBron 11 Terracotta Warrior. These actually release tomorrow or today if you're actually watching this on Tuesday and are inspired by the Terracotta Warriors in China. The electro purple on the Nike swoosh spices up the design quite a bit as does the textured print all over the hyperposite. Again, the release date for these has been changed to the 26th and they'll be dropping for $200 tomorrow the 26th. Now this next shoe is probably more for you old school sneakerheads than it is for you new guys. It is the Reebok DMX Run 10 and Frank the Butcher got his hands on a pair for Black Friday. The retro sneaker features a Kadura Ballistic Nylon upper with premium garment leather accents. The sneaker also features DMX 1015 embroidery on the heel and then 10 and 15 embroidered on the tongues and a smoke gray outsole. Officially these are called the Reebok DMX Run 10 and the 1015 is the uh, nickname for these. Uh, these will be releasing at Always BAU on Black Friday and they'll get a larger release on December 7th. And since we're talking about Black Friday, it seems like DJ Clark Kent is going to get his hands in the mix. See what I did there, that pun? DJ Clark Kent, hands in the mix. Okay, anyway, it's about his Nike SB collection. Seen on the Duck Low SB and the P-Rod Hyperfuse Max, Clark applies his mix of the Air Max 95 and Elephant Print, better known as 112, to both of the silhouettes. Outside of the boat hits, the shoe remains a black and gray color scheme with reflective 3M for some additional flavor. Look for the Clark Kent Nike SB collection to drop on Black Friday at select retailers. And if you're in LA, you can hit a Primitive where they're doing a special release of the shoe with their own version of the Hyperfuse Max. If you're the type that just can't wait till Black Friday to get a new pair of shoes, well this Wednesday Nike Sportswear has a little something for you that's all about the Safari. First is the Foam Posit which uses the famous print all over the upper and touches of black and total orange over the laces, eyelets, and the liner. The second pair is the Air Force One which rocks a similar upper, added the Safari on the overlays leaving the toe box, the liner, and the sole to split the duties on the dark gray, black, and total orange. Now both of these pairs will be dropping on Wednesday, that's 1027 with the Safari Foam going for $235 and the Air Force One going for $100. If you are a fan of Retro J's, well, the Air Jordan 5 Oreo got official for us today as well. These are honestly starting to look better and better to me every time I see them. The icy blue sole against the mostly black upper is really, really winning me over. I really like the details on the speckles on the teeth on the midsole as well. Shout out to Tinker Hatfield for that small design detail. Now, there are some rumors going around that these will be releasing for $160 on Friday, but from my sources, I've been told that they will release for $170. And finally, it looks like Kanye West is making the move from Nike to Adidas. Uh, this it seems like it's a big deal in the sneaker world. The blogs are all over it. So I thought I would mention it to you guys and I'm gonna get your perspective. Do you care that Kanye signs with Adidas or do you think it was better for him to be at Nike? Let me know down in the comments and I'll hop down there as well and we'll all talk about it and discuss and call each other names and troll each other and things like that. All right, well, if you haven't already, make sure you like, favorite, and subscribe. That way you know whenever something awesome is happening here on this channel and also visit the links down in the description. It'll give you the full stories of everything that I talked about today. Well, I am your host, Jacques Slade. This is Today in Sneaks, and I will see you soon. Peace.